For the victory puffs section, you need to know how to make a puff stitch. So I've started the row with uh, just the basic stitches, which I'm sure you'll know, and now I'll show you how to make a puff stitch. Um, a puff stitch is made up with strands of yarn that are pulled, uh, longer strands that are pulled up and cinched together at the top and they make a sort of puffy collection of yarn squidged together. Um, so let me show you how to do that. Um, it starts in a similar way as a treble, so we yarn over and for this pattern we're going to make the puff, we need to skip two and we make the puffs into this third stitch. So we yarn over and pull the yarn through and then we pull it up to the height of the row we're working on. So you want to pull it up to the height of a treble. And then we do the same, so that's one, that counts as. So we do the same thing for um, a twice more because this is a puff stitch that's made up of three trebles. So this sort of counts as one treble even though it's not a proper treble. So we'll do another one by yarning over going into the stitch, yarn over and pull through and pull it up to that height again. So that's two and we'll just do that once more. So yarn over, into the stitch, yarn over and pull through and pull up to that height. So we have six loops that are going to make up our puff and our original working loop. So to work those together, we just yarn over and I go through all six of those loops and so that leaves us with two and then to secure it so the strands aren't going to go anywhere just yarn over and go through those two so that squashes all those lovely strands together and makes that really nice sort of puffy bump so for this particular pattern we're going to do two of these puffs into the same place so we've got a regular v-stitch and this is we're going to make a sort of puffy v-stitch so we chain one and then we make another puff stitch in the same place so yarn over as you would for a treble into the same place yarn over and pull through and bring up to the height of the current row and again so yarn over into the stitch yarn over and pull through pull that yarn up to the height and third time yarn over into the stitch yarn over pull through and pull up to the height so once you have your six loops on there you can yarn over pull through those six then yarn over and pull through two and there we've got a nice puffy version of the v-stitch